Hi, this is Gene from eLearning, and this is Validating Blackboard Tests with Student Preview. There are two parts to implementing a new test in Blackboard, designing the test and deploying the test. Students do not have access to the test in the design phase. However, when the instructor deploys the test by placing it in a content area, they must be careful that it is not visible to their students until the date on which it will be administered. An instructor must set the test as available to their students, or it will never become visible. Therefore, they restrict access to the test by setting the availability dates within the test options. There are a number of other test options an instructor needs to set and which they would like to validate before they present the test to the students. For this, they want to use their preview student to take the test in the same way that one of their actual students would. This video shows a potential obstacle that may occur in doing that and how it can be overcome. In this example, we see that the instructor has made the test available to students but set the availability dates for November, although it is now October. They then invoke the student preview by clicking on the button near the top right of the screen. Next, they try to take the test as their preview student, but discover that they cannot, as they are subject to the same date limitations as their own students. However, there is a workaround. One of the test settings is the test availability exceptions. This is normally used to allow students needing special accommodations to have a special availability or duration period during the test. In this case, as the instructor, we will set the test availability exceptions to allow the instructor to have early admission to the test using their preview user. To add an exception for the preview user, in the Test Options window, scroll down to the Test Availability Exceptions and click Add User or Group. The preview user's name is the same as the instructor's followed by an underscore in Preview Users. It is that name to which you will grant an exception. Select the preview user from the list of students, then choose Today's Date and the current time to gain access to the test right away. Submit to save your changes. You can now return to the content area as the preview student and take the test and validate your test results. You can also verify that the test results are posted to the student's My Grades, either as needs grading or as a grade, depending on the type of questions on your test. If there is a problem with your validation procedures, you can simply edit your test options and repeat the validation procedures. I hope you found this video helpful. For further information, please visit our website, elearning.umb.edu, or email elearning at umb.edu. Thank you.